But you have to have strict respect in the sport because horses, just because they're very big, horses are kindly souls for the most part. They're not like nice puppy dogs, but they're sweet, most of them are nice, but they're big. And a horse is not too bright. He has the brain of about a two-year-old child, despite what you like to think. They have great memory. They have great, great memory. And we teach them by association. But they're not rocket scientists. But just because they're big, they'll hurt you. They'll bite you, they'll kick you, they'll trip over a jump, fall down on you. So, they say it's one of the three highest risk sports. So I don't put up with much around horses because of that. And also, I'm only interested in excellence. Even if you go cross country or fox hunt, I'm interested in excellence. And you don't get excellence living in a playpen. You have to concentrate, it's detail. Practice people doesn't make perfect. You, you hear practice makes perfect. Perfect practice makes perfect. Not that we expect perfection. Not that we ever attain perfection. But we try. Be that give and take. Not that we'll ever have it perfect, because you're a little bit of a, a lot of you, you, a lot of you girls hang on to a horse too much. You don't wait in like I did that chestnut, which I taught you today. What's this called? Give and take, take and give. But see, that takes practice, that takes concentration, just how much to take, just how much to give. We don't expect you to be perfect, but our goal is to be perfect. And if that's your goal, you'll do better than the other people.